Can you hear me? This is ready to watch Fright be bad at games. Fuck you. Okay, I'm a bit loud. I just realized that. <laughs> Alright, Jerry, say something. Did you hear Jerry? Oh, hi, Chew. <laughs> In fact, sea snakes, the ones that go for fish. How about now? Those Anyways. Ones, yeah, those ones people fear running into even more. Probably because of the poison, but they just want fish. Oh shit, I forgot to plug in my controller. Give me a moment. <laughs> You're not just building too! Professional streamer, everybody. Uh, motherfucker, I never call myself a professional streamer. <laughs> oh, wait, I just realized. My door is still closed, so in case bus ones get in, they can't get in. Give me a moment. You'll have to look at land snakes to see snakes that eat mice. And yes, I agree with Chew. Sea snakes to... eat mice. And I am allowed to be as wrong as I want and cite no sources. I'm gonna point out, mice don't live in the ocean. Yeah, they do. They're called sea mice. <laughs> this is a Pokemon. So I'm not in the ocean right now. No, you're not in the ocean. I don't know. You can't <laughs> prove that. You? I don't even know yeah. if you've gone to the beach. If you, exactly. So for all you know, I could be. You have you ever gone to the beach? Yes. When? I don't need to tell you my personal history. You're not my therapist. Sounds like you haven't gone for a long damn time. So what if I haven't? You're not my doctor or my therapist. Well, I'm and not I'll, a I'll professional therapist and I'm not a professional <laughs> doctor. And I don't know why a doctor would ask why you're going to the ocean. A psychiatrist probably would, so ask about my past. That's fair. A psychiatrist would probably ask about the ocean at some point, maybe. So, so I win. Hmm, sorry about that. I don't feel like that's a win. In my head it is, and that's what matters the most to me. What the fuck is going on? Sea snakes eat fish. I've heard about them eating lizards. They do not eat mice. But have you... Ever got them to see if they could eat a mice? Alright, I'm gonna need you to stop enabling and encouraging bad behavior. <laughs> Especially bad behavior that is a threat to me. Oh, I find the painting! <laughs> it's a snake painting, too! <laughs> wow, the one room you didn't go in. I just looked it up on Google. Can sea snakes eat mice? The answer was no. But have they tried? Those, those sources are rigged. The, the source said no. You cannot feed them mice. They do not eat mice. They cannot eat mice. Well, I want to point out, the sea snakes are not <laughs> close relatives to land snakes. Well, I don't believe your source. So, beat that. <laughs> Anyways, welcome to the Gallery of Despair, a wondrous display of, of those few who succeeded in obtaining at least one mask. Set your sights upon those chosen few whose final moments of despair are preserved forever in this gallery.
witness in his collection, The Light of Life, from a different perspective. Jigsaw moment. What the fuck was that? I heard something. Huh? Oh. Oh, no, this is... Is apparently a magical place. I looked at other sources Google had, besides the first one that popped up, and they were stupid. One person's like, can I feed my sea snake a mouse? And one okay, said, yeah, I have a water snake, you can occasionally feed the mice. Water snakes are not sea snakes. fuck was that? Why did I just stay there? What did you say to? I said they're all new, so I went. Yeah. Is this a safe area? Oh, they were asking about water snakes anyway. Not even sea snakes. What? Why does Google suck? I don't know. Because they're adding AI overviews to it. Oh, yeah, I need more key parts. <laughs> you know what? You're actually right. That is literally why it sucks. Yeah, give me I'm a always moment. right. All right. Okay, the statues. So yeah, water snakes can occasionally eat mice, sometimes, and they are not sea snakes. Sea snakes cannot eat mice. Okay. I got two of the three masks. There are videos of water snakes attacking people's clothing because the clothing smells like fish. Like, are you a fish? Noms on pants. I don't know how to respond to that. Well, too, you don't smell like fish. Well, I'm assuming you don't smell like fish. Right, I was about to say, you were... Like, staring intently at those picture frames. You, you having a little bit of trouble? No. She just solved sure. it. To mess with me? She just solved it. Damn straight. I don't no, like no. the eyeball. No straight. No straight. That's not allowed this month. <laughs> he gets glory onto those or whatever. <laughs> mm-hmm. Not allowed this month. Very correct, the three I key needs to go over here. Uh. Yeah. Got the boomstick, bright. I got the boomstick. Why does it sound like I say dick instead of stick <laughs> when I say boomstick? I think I think the intrusive thoughts are getting in. <laughs> I think she's already had those thoughts a long time ago. Can't get us. By the way, bright. When you said boomstick, I heard boomstick. Not boom dick. <laughs> so that was all you. All you. The term boom dick made a very specific image come to my head. I will not elaborate further. I'm still standing. I wouldn't be here without you. 
The voice is concerned about you. Making doors and whatever. It's more than my parents. I'm sorry. Is that why you can't do it whenever you want? Oof, would be nice though. One night. Wait, what? What do you say, wait, what to? I don't know, I thought you said something. Yeah, I said more than my parents. More than what your parents? You said it, that the voice is concerned about you, and I said, yeah, more than my parents. Oh, oh, that's a bad joke! That's a bad <laughs> joke! You know what? At least the character you're playing has a parent that's concerned about them. The other one is too dead to concern, but one one is alive enough to concern. Yeah, I just the gotta figure. Oh. Huh? I just have to figure out where to go. Good luck. Let's see how you. See, you, bitch. Don't die. <laughs> Then again, if she says anything, would we know if he's telling the truth or telling you how to die? Yes! Here we go. Oh my goodness. I see- oh, I see the final mask! I really should have saved. I can see dead people. Alright, before I do this, because I unlocked the area, nothing bad happened yet. Go save. Oh. Oh, that, that, oh, great. We have Pyramid Head over here. Ow, god fucking damn it. Go through the goddamn doors. Okay. Man, I'm glad I mean I have three of those. Alright. Where's the printer? Oh wait, no, this is a typewriter, not a printer. Alright, <laughs> is this game the first time you've seen a typewriter? <laughs> Yeah, in person, yeah. This isn't in person, Bright. This is not in person. Shut up, you know what I meant. No! Um, those are not even Typewriters are heavy! And they're so cool to type on. Also, I have no idea if that big motherfucker is actually killable. Telling you nothing. When I used to visit my auntie and uncle when I was a little kid, I'd play with their typewriter and just imagine myself writing books. That was cool. No idea if I'm killing it. Try and find out. You won't know until you try. I would not try it. Man, I need to find some weed. Just say you want to make medicine! Also, I'm not helping you with this puzzle. You're smart, you'll figure it out yourself. Is she smart? Yes, I found no, some weed! Just, I just don't wanna. Plus, I'm just an asshole, so there's that too. I get too close to that. Okay. So there has to be another one that I can reach. Uh, 
had this. But I was a waste of bullets. Do you want me to try to look up the puzzle? No, 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 no. No help. No helpers. There might be something downstairs that I missed. And there's doggos barking downstairs. Which dog is it? <laughs> the only one that really barks in the house? Uh, buddy. Buster? Buddy. Oh. No, Buster rarely buddy. ever barks. Well, I don't live with you. I don't know how much Busta does or doesn't bark. You think I'm watching your dogs all the way from California? Yes. Oh, wait, can I climb on top of this? Oh! oh I don't mean to do that. Get the back on there. That's great and all. However, I'm still too far away to reach. Maybe there's something you can step on upstairs to get you closer there. See anything to step on? There's this area. Oh, gunpowder. Wait, there's a door. You missed an entire door. Of course she did. She's bright. It's this well, area. She's bright doesn't mean she's gonna miss entire doorway. I. Oh my God. I just looped back around. Okay. Honestly, I found the third max mask a lot faster than I thought I would. To be honest. And now you're in a puzzle you need to figure out. Yeah. Ooh, more ammo. Okay. So this just leads me down this way. Well, how close can you get to the flower that's upstairs? Not very. Can you step on the chair? No. Not I think... the table either, I'm assuming. Nope. Is that furniture you can step on at the other side? Nope. There has to be like a third one or something. I wonder, if you jump down from there, do you think you'd be able to land on anything? You can't jump. Oh. Yeah. I think it's actually kind of rare for Resident Evil games to give you the ability to jump. Like, with a button. You'll figure it out. If I can do it, you can do it. It's so close. Her mercy. No, it's fine, what the Jerry. What does that mean? This isn't Undertale. Well, Mercy exists outside of Undertale, too. Not in my heart, it doesn't. It does in mine. Fine. You want me to give mercy? Yeah. 
bright the solution to the puzzle is in. Oh, I see it. Just make sure you look around. Hope that helps. I, I see it. It's right there. The second very nice friend. I see it. Also, Jerry made you use up your one Pikachu hat. So, blame Jerry. Thanks, Terry. I'm sorry. <laughs> You it's can right consider there. it me using up a two hint and not bright because he did not ask for it. Nope, no takes these backsies. There you are. There, you motherfucker. He didn't even ask. I did. And there goes the table. Oh, what the fuck? Well, it's good you have a gun and ammo. Boom, bitch! Okay, okay. Run, 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 run. Uh, uh, I don't know what this says. Grenade, uh. Grenades tend to blow up. God damn it. Okay. I thought you had a bigger gun. The one on your back. I only have two bullets. Oh. Okay. Ooh, how did I pull off those good shots three times in a row? How did I survive? Divine intervention. <laughs> I like how I just panic and just toss the grenade right at my own feet. Does this mean after you do this, more zombies will come at you? Most likely. Wait, what happened? Who knows? Oh, I can get the one up there now. Okay. Does that mean there's one dead up here? <laughs> you... Damn it, Jerry. Hey, I didn't make them pop up. I just guessed very well. <laughs> Considering they come out of the goo when it's cleared, and you clear some. Ooh, more shotgun ammo. I will gladly take that. Wait. Oh, I can make shotgun ammo now. As well as a pipe bomb. I know how to make a pipe bomb. <laughs> pipe bomb goes boom. I made more shotgun ammo. I have a lot of undead to shoot soon. It's okay, I got the boomstick. Just don't run at them. Ain't nobody here, Jerry. Hmm. I... I hear them. That's what I thought. Not there, my butt. Oh, it's a cutscene. Easy peasy. <sighs> what now? Probably that. Crystalline prize. I knew the real 
so much more lively. It would be a shame to snuff you out so unceremoniously. Shall we prolong our fun a little longer? Oh, come now, don't pout. I've prepared a nice little diversion for you. Just remember this isn't so the real dude. Oh, many Squarosha. Nearly all of them are counterfeit. How crafty is the real dude? Suss out the real one? I don't know. This is just a recreation. A corrupted recreation of him. That's true. You'll be swallowed right up if you don't hurry. How am I supposed to tell the difference? Right. Look up. I see it. Left lower barrel. I don't know what that means. No, right. You're gonna read the whole sentence. <laughs> You're not even close. There's a right. You missed okay. a word in the middle. Lower. You said lower than barrel. Just ninety seconds left. Oh. Big core. Deep shadow. Oh. No, Bitch. Oh god. Up. Further. Close now. Center. Oh. Bitch. Ooh. Are you gonna get the ammo behind you? That's over. Okay, that can't be broken. <laughs> right on the shelf. Or down. He's abandoning the gun. Wait, what? Do you said multiple times. Gun, gun ammo behind you. No, I, I didn't hear chew. That's why I was saying, wait, what? Oh. I know my mic isn't muted. Uh. Still bad at games. Okay. I couldn't have done it without you. I was hoping for a pony, but I guess this'll do. What the? What's a pony gonna do with those things? Right. That's what's known as a joke. I don't, I'm sorry, but we don't accept jokes on this channel. Yes, you do. You know how many horny jokes you tell. Well, no one laughs, so they aren't jokes. <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's funny jokes. Lots of people tell jokes people don't laugh at. It doesn't mean it isn't a joke. It just means that you're terrible at comedy. But I'm bummed. I just need bitch. Okay, so I've gotten a lot better at shooting those things now, which is funny because I was so terrible <laughs> when I first started the DLC. Where am I at? Okay. So I don't think I'm f that far away from where we placed the mask. Did you save? I mean, I already saved work, so... Oh yeah, wow. Okay. Almost time! Yeah. I can finally get rid of these powers. But I have to admit, I've lived with them for so long.
<laughs> kind of weird to let them go. I know. I know. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Looks like the real thing, doesn't it? Oh, you bitch. <laughs> it's a replica, of course. Nothing that valuable could ever manifest on this stratum. <laughs> Did you really think I'd give away something so precious? Airplane. I had to bait the trap with something. Ooh. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm required to be an ass. It's my job. I have a feeling you're not nearly done with this. <coughs> well, I know it's not going to be as long as the game. <laughs> now comes the real fun. The perfect place for your demise. <laughs> Let the show begin! You're kidding! You have to fight him? Oh, this is probably the final boss. Okay. Yep. Even uglier now. Good luck. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> I. How is this thing? Why is that thing faster than me? That ain't fair. <laughs> it's not supposed to be fair. Do you know what a fair fight is, Bray? <laughs> That's a fair a fight is one that you're not willing to lose. You're not the best aim on Well, I hit the aim button and it pointed right towards his legs and wouldn't let me go up. Well then, unpack it and you have to manually Yeah! Fuck you, bitch! Run, run, run. Did, I, did I do it? Well, look at you! So much feistier than those up to the Ah, oh, the sexist head. This is becoming cheese. Uh-oh. Time to shake things up! Oh, I don't like this. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! How is this fair? How is this fair? Out of my way. You should have walked away. So cheat. If you can cheat, do it. Okay. Go, go, go. Fuck. Fuck. Move. Move. What the fuck are you doing? I guess you made another one. <laughs> no, it's the same one you just got. There. Oh. Like the Energizer level. <laughs> and then Zombie would get down Mr. President as I shot his leg. Oh, god damn it. I was fixing my headset and I didn't think it would run this way. Wrong. Oh shit. I am out of shotgun yeah, ammo. Uh, I was gonna tell you that in these games it does more shotguns do more damage when you get up close. I forgot to mention those. You did that on purpose. 
It won't let me aim on it. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, he died. Well, he died. You call this a show? Well, you gotta open the fucking gate for me to kill them, asshole. Don't let her get away with that. Okay. I don't know what that does. When I catch some more shank honey mo. Okay. What the fuck? You mean you wanna see if Sprite remembered that you said the shot gun does more amp damage up close? I never said that. That's not what... Yeah, you didn't tell me this fucker can teleport. Oh, the night bench. You did not mention the teleporting. I can't move! This is bullshit! I'm glad I put it on easy. I would be so dead. Okay, ready to go. Right, this really is not hard fight. You just have to have situation awareness and not stay in one place for too long. It's a not always the best at God damn it. Man, I'm glad I got multiple of these. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh! That's some bullshit! I was turning around to fight it! It won't turn around for me to hit it! Oh, fuck off. Ha, <laughs> missed me because I didn't stop moving, bitch. Right, don't celebrate until the fight's over. That's fighting one-on-one. Yeah. If you pretty much really celebrate, that's the time there's a more of you. Okay. Ooh, ooh, okay, thank fight. goodness you hit a wall. Good thing you hit a wall. I know. It's hard. Seeing how this thing is faster, ink can teleport. Why are you have a hard time getting close to giant man? Fine. I will give you this one hand. It won't teleport if you get really, really far away from it. So stop being afraid. It won't get you. Oh, a bit too late. Be ready. A bit close, but not too close. Just a little ring around the rosy, you know. Isn't that a song that originated with the plague? Okay. It's teleporting, Chew! Uh, it must have thought you were running away. It either does it when you're starting to do more damage, or if it, if it thinks you're getting too far away. Enough with the dilly 
Finish this. As a sign that the phase is progressing, like the fence for the laser test. Go, go now. Boom, bitch. You were almost in the fight longer because you didn't go into it. Yes, a part back. Wow, I did that first try. No matter. You're welcome. Your imminent demise <laughs> is inevitable. No shit. Oh, the yellow glow road. What? Down there? You'll die in your skin. Um, Bright, would you like to know something funny? Want to hear a joke? All that stuff I said about the boss teleporting, I just, I just made up. I don't know if that's true or not. Oh, oh, fuck oh. off. Well, I whooped its ass, so I don't care. I mean, I'm pretty sure the... F mm. I'm pretty sure doing damage is what... is part of it. <clears throat> Where am I now? What's that noise? I think Jerry's chair. Probably. Uh. The deeper you go, the harder to escape. I don't want to leave. Not until I find that crystal. I'm tired of being a freak. I want to have friends. I want to live a normal life. Without this... curse. If that purifying crystal can make that happen, Make me normal. Then I'm not going back until I find it. Rose, I hate to break it to you, but there's no such thing as normal. Uh, so? Maybe normal exists for some people. Normal is made up by people. Right, and it varies. What is that creepy? Normal does or doesn't exist when you haven't been normal either. He uh -huh. must have been normal. That proves my point. What normal is, is subjective. This? Define normal. I don't know. Exactly. I've always been othered. I've always been outside the box. Name a one normal person. Everyone I grew up around. <laughs> what makes them normal? Well, everyone besides the one kid that had cancer. I think it's normal to get cancer, unfortunately. Well, not cancer so hard that his body was basically left very bad shape. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> Will you be my friend? No, fuck off, you die. I'm gonna shotgun you in the face. <laughs> I'm sorry. Right? Be friends with the doll, I guess. <laughs> Depends if it's the sex kind or the regular kind. Right! No! <laughs> You're playing a girl! A little girl! Let's play. Actually, I have no idea how old she is. I'm just assuming she's, she's a child. She's 16. There we go! No sex dolls while you're playing a child. I didn't say it was for her. You're to playing be fair. her! To be fair, Bright didn't say it was for Rose. Oh, I hate no. being... What's wrong? I hate defending, but I have to when it's fair. It is fair, mm. but I also have to say she is playing Rose. Yeah, it's fair. Oh. Oh, well, that's normal. So things you rated while you're playing the 16 year old. Oh god, I'm gonna die. 
Okay. That's this a bit younger when I'm 16. And creepy. Hey, shoot, you don't have to tell me what happens next, but... Am I at the halfway point or past the halfway point? Oh, wait, no, you don't know. <laughs> Hang on, I'm in the middle of a Splatoon yes. match right now. I will look at your screen in a second. That sounds like you won't be able to answer for a few minutes. Jerry, there's only like two and a half minutes left in the match, and that's assuming I don't win by knockout. Yeah, anyways. I'll be there momentarily. Got it. January 5th. Today was my first day of school. I've always wanted to go. I want to give Chris a big hug next time I see him. There are so many kids my age. It was like I walked into a TV show or something. I was so scared when, when I had to introduce myself to the class. But I was super duper excited to be there. I want to make so many friends. I want to try and talk to them tomorrow. January 8th. I tried to be brave. Wait. Mm -hmm. What? Never be excited to, to make friends at school. Oh my god. I speak, I speak from experience. Same. Unless my experience <laughs> isn't real. Your experience is real, but some people get very excited to make friends and make them fast and easy. I'm so glad for some people, but I'm not some people. I'm me. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Anyways, January 8th. I tried to be brave and talk to some other kids, but no one wants to talk to me. Schoolwork is super easy. It's all stuff I learned with mommy. But I guess I shouldn't answer all the teacher's questions. The boy behind me said something really mean. My hands go icky with white sweat when I panic. It was really bad today. February 10th. Today the teacher yelled at me for always carrying my hanky. She says I'm not a baby anymore. The boys at school keeps saying I'm icky. But I take a bath every night, always wear clean clothes, and bring a fresh hanky every day. It's because of my stupid white sweat. Whenever it starts coming out of my hands, I wipe it off right away. But sometimes, it won't wipe off. So I just hold my ha hanky really tight. Chris even told the teacher if I can't, it can't get anyone sick. But it didn't change anything. April 4th. Someone finally talked to me. Huh? Are you about to say something to you? No, I'm, like I said, I'm playing a third-person shooting game, so I'm gonna make noises, especially since I'm using motion controls. Oh, that's fair. Anyways, April 4th, someone finally talked to me. Lucy from my class said she always wanted to be friends. We're gonna have lunch together tomorrow. I can't believe it. I'm so happy. I Don't hope... trust her. Yeah, I hope okay. Lucy's friend, Catherine, will be my friend, too. And then they both end up dead. All right, my match is done. Match is over. What's happening? Uh, I'm at. I think her name is like Benevito's house. Can't remember. Benevito. Benevito. Yeah. I was just wondering if I was past the halfway point or at it. Um, I didn't measure the. Why I didn't measure the gameplay. Mind? Um, all I know is that this is one of, you know what, I don't know, so I'm just going to say, sure, you're at the halfway point, because I don't know. There's this right there, but there's no way to get it. I bright have fun. Fuck yeah, I get to perform transgender surgery? That, that's not what it is. And of course, this is a room might be minimal. Use that brain. What brain? <laughs> Boy! <laughs> well, <laughs> I suggest that you find one, because I'm not helping. Unless you get so stuck that it's unbearable to watch. And it'll be hard to watch because I'm playing. 
Oh, looks like you can't hide this time. I hear Steward listening to chicken attack. Jimmy's room. Honestly, I don't think any of us wants to be friends with Cousin Jimmy. Fuck Jimmy. All my homies hate Jimmy. I don't have a relative named Jimmy. <laughs> I will I... neither confirm nor deny that I have a relative named Jimmy. I, uh, Jerry, I was referencing uh, a Keter class anomaly. Oh. Yeah, Cousin Jimmy, uh, there's some really fucked up shit. Like, one time, when their when a family was doing, like, I think it's called a christening, where they dump their head in water or something like that. You mean like when they take a champagne bottle and hit the side of a boat before sending it on a maiden voyage? They're not hitting the baby with a champagne. <laughs> I didn't hear the whole thing. I'm... I kind of have the volume up on my game right now. I, I was saying, like, when they dumped the a baby in water, like, baptism-like thing. You mean... Oh, baptism? Yeah. Wait, how do you not know what baptizing is? You're Christian, right? <laughs> What's even worse is, is I was raised Baptist. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways... Like I was saying, during a, a baptism a family was doing, um, Cousin Jimmy came in, and uh, he made both the parents tear the, the infant apart and eat it. I only heard the first half of that. Say again. Uh, Cousin Jimmy, the anomaly, made um, the parents of the infant tear it apart and eat it. Oh, I thought you were talking about a real person. No! <laughs> that would be so fucked! And yet, in today's world, it would make perfect sense. Oh my god. <laughs> anyway, Isn't st that the fun part they are of the world we live in? Thank you, Jerry. Anyways, yeah, the stuff locker, the picture on the bookshelf, the desk covered in stuff. Good luck. O2. Jesus. Oh, shit. Well, I guess you both swore around the same time. Yes, a, someone with a sword just came at me. I guess they're a sharp person. Okay, where was the picture again? I forgot. Okay, was that on the bookshelf? O2... O2-44. Oh wait, was it this desk? It might be this desk. O two O uh O two forty four sixty six Oh hi Moon Wake, how are you? Yeah. In your head, in your head. <laughs> oh my god. I can't reach out. Uh, what's happening? They were doing the zombie song. The what? Oh, shit. It's a. It's a. It's a. I 
I assume a popular song that's called Zombie. I don't know by who. You mean Cranberry? What? Zombie? Zombie by the Cranberries? Maybe. I don't know shit about music. Oh yeah, it is Cranberries. Well, that voice is familiar. Yeah, it's Angie. Yes, Don't right. You? It's Angie. Again? What now? Okay, before I go, I gotta piss so fucking badly. I I'll be. Go pee. Go for it. Go pee. I'll be right back after peeing a long period of time, or actually short period. I don't know. It depends on the pee. You're stalling. <laughs> Maybe Bright doesn't know how to see properly. I don't know. Bright already left. You're late. Oh. Damn. Also, I suppose we're supposed to entertain the stream. But I'm not going to do that. I don't get paid I'm to I'm too do boring that. to entertain anyone. I don't get paid to entertain. I get paid to look at chat. People look at land even... snakes and sell sea snakes for a reason. And I don't even get paid to watch the chat. I should get paid. Hi, uh, Moonwalk. Like... Yeah, it seems like Moonwake agreed cranberries. Yeah. I was a kid, I believe, when the cranberries were still super popular. I've listened to zombies play on MTV during the time it still had music that it played. There are actually none of their weird shows on it back then, so that was also awesome. It was just music back then, and sometimes the top 10 chart thing. I never watched MTV. Show. I had no reason to. Wait, what? I never watched MTV. I never had a reason to. Y you weren't a music fan? I've never been a music fan. When have I ever mentioned I like music? I thought everyone likes music. No, it irritates me. On the, except for the rare, rare occasions where it doesn't. I'm not sure how I feel about that. I've never met anyone who has bothered you by... Feel anything. You shouldn't feel anything about it because it's my preference and does not affect your material conditions. That is fair. But I was going to say that, you know, it confuses me. That's why, that's why I'm not sure what to think about it. I don't fully understand.
very nice. Also, Moon is being very quiet. Yeah, people are probably just lurking. I have lurkers in my stream all the time. Uh, or they're waiting for the lady of the hour to come back. said a 90 second ad break is starting. Thank you for sticking with us through this break. Ads help support my content. Consider subscribing to remove ads and support the stream. So I guess an ad played. This may sound bad to ask, but is she taking a shit? You wouldn't know. Alright, I'm back after my good, nice, gigantic, long piss. Yeah, no, it's just a piss. I mean, I drank a lot of vodka earlier, so. Boy! What? My my liver is fine. <laughs> oh, fucking trust that. <laughs> you can't find all the kind of places to play with, with this doll and her friends. Okay. I got Lucy. Oh. Okay. Maybe get a crystal once you get all the campfire started. 
Alright, so I got a key now. What the fuck? Okay, so there's... You clean the gross mold off of her. I guess you're supposed to clean one of the dolls. Guess so. And I can't go that way. Great. Someone really went all out. Hey, Jerry, look, it's Cousin Jimmy. So somewhere in here is probably another doll. Oh, great. There's even more doll shit I gotta mess with. What's this? <laughs> Catherine. Oh. That wants to be your friend. What a loser. Okay, so I need to get... I mean, yeah, you're right. I am a bitch, but what's the point? Not you, you little shit. I do not trust you. You have no gun. Okay, so Lucy. Put you there. And put Catherine here. Yes! We got the first one. Are you having fun yeah, with yeah, the dolls and mannequins, Bright? I mean, yeah. The girl is making fun of how you were bullied, and I guess your character Rose was bullied, and like they put fucking cleaner on her to clean her. Yeah. Now we're going to cousin Jimmy's room. Yeah, being covered in white mold sweat tends to be pretty gross. Yeah. Kids are less understanding and more. Ha ha ha. Let's clean her. Ha ha ha. I mean, she probably can't tell anybody, so there isn't really understanding that can be had. Because yeah. she's, she's quite literally a living biological weapon. Yeah. Wait, so the real question is, did Mia the mother get pregnant or... or before or after events of Resident Evil 7? What? God, this is so creepy. Right. Yeah? She would have been pregnant for nine months. Resident Evil 8 took place in 28, in like 2021 or 2022. No, no one ever accused Bright of being all that bright. But, okay, I'm gonna test something. It's gonna- I'm gonna look very stupid, but I'm gonna test it. It's right behind you, isn't it? Oh, it's not moving. But I still don't trust it. Why not? Are you joking? Who knows exactly why she doesn't trust it? Look, I have- like, I may act stupid all the time, but I still have some instincts. <laughs> okay. Yeah, like, flight, flight or fright. Or freeze. Oh, yeah. 
There was three, I remember. There was three in it, uh... Janet... Uh... Closet area. Who was drawing on the walls? I mean, the yeah, child. that's normal. The child Brett is currently dealing with probably did it. Granted, I drew a bunch of penises on the walls when I was a little kid. Except I thought I was drawing Thank rockets, you. but they didn't look like rockets. I want to guess this one's Lucy. Okay. You can also examine things that are in your inventory. Yeah, I know. Oh, wait. I'm an idiot. Yeah, I know. Because the way their dolls are stationed with their arms and stuff. Him. Wait a minute. I just had a big brain moment. I will be right back. I gotta get a tiny screwdriver. Now. The centipede song. Okay, so that one's wrong. It's probably these two. Yeah! Oh, Jesus Christ! Back. The child's a bitch. Bro, you're still looking for the crystal? Fine. I'll help you out. Just take the elevator to me. Mommy might be upset that I'm helping you, though. Who are you? Well, luckily I got the breaker box key. Let's... Let's play statues. Fuck it, I knew it. We're gonna have some weeping angel bullshit. It's oh, game over right. if they catch you. I'm just in time for the fun part. Play first if you can. Fuse map. I would recommend that you save your game. Yeah, I agree too. Save early, save often. Nothing looks like the power's out. How is it already 7 o'clock? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, why is it dark over there if it's only seven? 
Okay. Well, you see, as the Earth goes around the sun, it tends to rotate. <laughs> I don't like that. So, Bri, you know, you're... because currently, even when it's eight o'clock around where I live, it's still bright as hell. Yeah. Anyway, too, what are you trying to say? I was gonna say, so you know your bad habit of looking at the floor. I would recommend you don't do that because the game will. Having your character, having Rose face the doll isn't enough. If you are not actively looking at it, it will move. Or in its general direction. Or if your view is obstructed. Yeah, that thing is following you. Well, move, okay, what if I do this? Let's move to study, go yeah, here. Pausing doesn't count, and also examine. You can press A to zoom in and read it. Now let's see if I can get this open. I have no idea if I'm going the right way. Well, if you're not, I guess you have to restart because I have no idea how you're getting past that hole. Oh wait, I looked at the floor for a second and she didn't. Either. I don't know if you're going the right way either. Okay. God, I fucking hate this fucking remote. Look up. Ooh, ooh. Oh. Right. Right. Would you yeah. like to use your powers to make it easy for you to run away later? Yeah. Keep your camera pointed at it. There's nothing interesting on the oh. floor. Okay, so it's not down here. I need to go. Close the fucking door. There's God damn it. <laughs> there's something I want to tell you. But where's the fun in that? Do you know where it is? Of course I do. I've watched people play this. Here's the bad part. Oh. I can only walk backwards. Wait, you didn't realize you could walk backwards? No, I know I can walk backwards. It's just that I can't... He thinks you can only walk backwards. Just use the force, Bright. Just use the force. I'm just trying to figure out how to get to where I need to go. Did you look at the map? Yes, but it, it, I... Are you <laughs> sure? The fact that you're frustrated think, makes me think that you did okay. not, in fact, look at the map. Press the letter A. Okay, I'm in the study. Yes, I'm Zoom in the... in. Yes, I, I see. So I need to go... Oh, God damn it! I need to go back there. You have demonstrated that you did not, in fact, read the map. Okay. Alright, good luck. Now to get this fucking thing open. Okay. I already get enough from things like this. Why, well, hello there. Uh, anyways. <laughs> Ow. Motherfucker. I already get enough of, from this from this 173. I don't need you doing it too. Thanks a lot, screwdriver, for stabbing me in the finger. Let's try that again. Okay, so what I need to do is not to go in the kitchen. You know what? Think of it. Kind of like that one SCP that you can't look away from without dying. I, I just referenced 173. <laughs> Fuck. Just oh, hi, Ra Ravis Crow. How are you? Wait, she can't get in here? Hmm. 
No. You can't roll from anything? Ow. Oh, oh, I don't. Oh, oh yeah, I lied. What'd you Look, lie about? Right, you made it. Don't <laughs> worry, it only gets easier from here. The hard part's over. They're not gonna come <gasps> in. You're what safe the until the lights go out. The lights went out. What the? Why was it behind me? Wait, what? So, you know what? Because you didn't look at the door. You, got, you gotta look at the door. But she was in the room! Yeah. This is where the strategy comes in. Goofy ass pose. See? Huh? You got it. And see, the hard part's over. Because now you've got two. Like I said, it gets easier. Woo! Bullshit! No, it does not. Yeah, that's part of the lie. It's only two, right? Yes, Bright. Don't worry, it's only two. Okay, so I got both those motherfuckers right there. What are you doing to him? <gasps> what the, the I fuck? Lied. The... There's three. How did that not kill me? <laughs> it gets easy every time. The reason you didn't die is because you have to walk a certain distance before the game activates them. But now they're activated, so. Oh, oh yeah, great. Right again, there's four. I fucking hate you, Chew. I hate me Dude, too. Why are you just doing this for your own amusement? You, know, you just answered your own question. Your own question. Wait, wait. Is that it? The door closed. See? I told you it only got easier. Okay. Fuck you that. Specifically to fuck with her. Yes. Yeah. And it all worked out. Work? Didn't it? <laughs> okay, it, it's good now, Cal. You're after the crystal, aren't you? Do you know where it is? <laughs> I've gathered some friends just for you. Entertain Now, why would Angie care about the crystal? going on here? Oh, poor little Rose. <laughs> I'm waiting for you in... Okay. I don't have to deal with that shit anymore. Yeah. Now you gotta deal with something else. I hope you read that note. Yeah, play hide and seek. Okay. Friends. Those were not friends. Well, that's not very nice. Friends, technically. You don't know until you try. I don't think they want to be friends with her specifically. Everyone thinks things. Thoughts are wrong sometimes. Or they're right. No, they're not. Prove it. Bright, go up and approach the doll from behind without being hostile. Jerry asked me to prove it. Thanks. Blame Jerry. I would have told you to run away. I guess I should keep heading this way. What, blame me for saying you can't trust? Not everyone wants to be friends? No, you said prove it. There's your proof that I was wrong. Or that I lied. Take your pick. I think they just wanted to find the way for! Fuck off, you bitch! Where is the little rose? Don't forget.
get to crouch. You. And great, I have no healing items. Oh, they're too busy attacking that. Uh, bye. <laughs> so many. They see me, I'm toast. There's gotta be something I can do. Oh god damn it! I'm back in the orange. Those cells are quite aggressive. Look, I've killed this bitch before and I can kill her again. Okay. Nope, too far away. Just keep hidden and you're behind. Oh, my switch made noise. Oh, dying battery. Still too far away. Damn it, I can't leave this spot without being seen. Are you looking in every single direction? Woo! Woo! I did it! I did it! I moved! I moved! I moved! Okay. Stop panicking, stop panicking. Just go, just go, just go, just go. Okay. Where the fuck do I go from here? No clue. Yeah. 
one thing that sucks is that some of the noises in the game would sound so much like Jimmy's chair. I'm sorry. You know what happens to little girls you can't play nice, don't you? They get punished. No way. <laughs> You'll be fine, right? As long as you look at her, it won't get you. Uh huh. Yeah, it's moving without me. I'm not an idiot, you. I didn't, say it would, I didn't say it wouldn't move. I said it wouldn't get you. There's a very... Just, there's a huge difference. Pretty sure it's the deal with not being in her spotlight. Yeah. Then don't get in the spotlight, but keep looking. See ya, bitch. Right, did you happen to pick up anything that could help you? Oh wait, yeah. Back. Well, I don't have to worry about her anymore. Right, they respawn. Are they respawn? Yeah. The game's not that easy. Much better. Right? Are you making chubset faces like your avatar was a moment ago? Possibly. I think the bedroom is just over there. Uh, the Discord feed is getting like really laggy. Really? A little, yeah. I can't tell if it's also happening on Twitch though. Ha! <laughs> Bitch! God damn it, I'm dead. Uh, you wouldn't have gotten through anyway, because you didn't use the powers on the thing. I didn't focus on the last one, and I still got past it. I meant the core, right? You have to use your powers on the core. And there was one right there that you just ran past. Oh, I didn't know that.
Fuck you. Right, I would leave. Yeah, what do you think I'm going to try and do? But I got a big ass motherfucker right there. It looks like you're trying to go back the way you came. Oh yeah, that's right. Good job, right? Right, you can't really talk shit when you don't know what you're doing. Make sure it can't see me through this area. No, I can't. Okay, let's go. And see ya, bitch. Okay. Forest run. So you're the girl without any friends. Why was I running towards the direction of the bad doll? You bitch. I can't take much more of this. Why are they talking well, about my dad? I never even met him. No. I don't know. I don't know the first thing about him. I wish I did. All I know is he died protecting me. Sometimes, I try to imagine what my life would have been like if he hadn't died. Oh, he taught me how to bike, helped me with my homework, told me a story every night. Would he have been there for me, proud of me? Sometimes, when I feel lost or afraid, I try to imagine what he might have said to me. Feels familiar, like I've been here before. Look at all the decorations. Some kind of party? Dude, decorate the living room. Done. Get wine, put it in the dining room. Yep. Rosa's other present in study. Hidden. I'm so lucky to have you both in my that voice is that dad yeah right examine everything don't this rush must be my parents house from when i was Trust a baby me. i bet hey, don't worry i wasn't planning on it also have my dad's memories she's so little <laughs> hard to believe one day she'll be old enough to share a bottle of wine with her old man so dad was well, a wine i'll be right there. back
I think if I wasn't watching Bright's live stream, I'd probably be napping. Sorry about that. Buster, we need to go to the bathroom. But yeah, I am unmuted, right? Yeah. Okay. No. I can't hear you. Oh my god. She bangs her spoon every time I play this. I wonder if she'll be a musician. I wonder if Dad played any instruments. <sighs> just finished the last of my vodka. She just cannot get enough of this stuff. <laughs> I bet Dad would feed me as soon as I started crying. Rose is such a picky eater. All she ever wants is fruit puree. I guess I've always loved fruit. Can I just say this as a baby? I kid you not. Like, apparently when I was told, I would get upset if I was not given a raw tomato to eat and Dr. Pepper to drink. My mom would have never let me have soda as a baby. Maybe that's why I, I'm I really love Dr. Pepper since I was giving it as a child. Man, what kind of irresponsible parent would never mind? <laughs> that was quick. Oh yeah. Well, I got reminded in my brain what kind of parents you had, so Yeah. Okay, I wanna save again. Also, um, one other thing, one other thing that's interesting, um, Dr. Pepper 
beat Pepsi as the as number two. Dr. Pepper is now number two with Coca-Cola being at one. They're very different drinks too, so I find that hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> This tune has always been special for our family. Well, I think I've heard this before. It's pretty. Yeah, but apparently, I'm not sure if it was Twitter or somewhere else, but they're getting people are getting really pissed off that Pepsi's now number two. But well, not Pepsi number two. Dr. Pepper. God damn it! I mixed the drinks. <laughs> You know what Wait, I meant. What? They were upset Dr. Pepper was at number two? No, they were upset that Dr. Pepper was number two. I'm going to point out Dr. Pepper has been consistently cheaper than Coke or Pepsi in recent times. This is my bedroom? Yeah. She's growing so fast. <sighs> Getting bigger every day. Oh, this crib is so little. And you know what? Uh, unlike the other two drinks, Dr. Pepper actually has some ass in it. It actually has real fla different flavors, too. It, did you not hear what I said, Jerry? You said ass. Yeah, because there's, there's a... I think it's a plant, but it, there, it it's, it's called anus. <laughs> It's one of the flavors. <laughs> and he cracks me up every time. He's already growing out of these onesies. I can't believe I was ever this tiny. It's called growing up. Okay. Yeah, I want to check other ones before that because that looks like the study, and I think the last thing. Was mentioned was the study. I didn't check out the other rooms yet. Yeah, I didn't check here. Okay, there's nothing over here. Oh, what is this? Ethan, don't forget Rosa's half birthday is on the second. I'm going to make an amazing cake, so you better eat it. In fact, I'm going to make a cake for every special occasion we have. I want you to take lots of pictures for our family album. I Do seen Mom people yeah. actually celebrate half birthdays? I thought it was just... Yeah. I thought it was a joke. No. Why? Right? Maybe if you had a happier childhood, you'd get it. Yeah, probably. So you've had half birthdays? Yeah, they're not quite a birthday. They're just sort of like a little celebration. Uh -huh. They're kind of like a half birthday. February 2nd is our half birthday. Half a year in the blink of an eye. I wanted to capture this mo moment, these feelings, so I wrote something special. May have gotten a bit sappy, though. I'd feel embarrassed if anyone stumbled across it. So it's safe in the side board for now. The key is behind my favorite photo. Ah, now I get to get the key. I wonder if she'll look like me when she grows up. Oh, I look so happy. Oh. Here we go. A letter for me. Happy half birthday, Rose. My gift to you is a promise. I'll always be there for you, no matter what. I'll be there every oh. day to watch you blow out the candles on your cake. I'll be there to make you breakfast and walk you to school every day. I'll be there when you have a bad dream and sing to you until you fall back asleep. 
I'll hug you tight oh. when you're troubled or worried and tell you that everything's going to be all right. You are my precious rose. Never forget that. Dad. No one loves you. What the fuck? Okay, so bright that wasn't Angie. Oh, it's this bitch. Yeah, I tried to tell you, but no one ever listens to me. <laughs> Typical. That's fine, I can kill her again too. Guess what? She's already dead, what do you mean? Don't you know you can kill a dead a person? <laughs> this is a hive mind. Isn't here. So, you don't have the purifying crystal? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> For that, you'll have to go deeper. Much deeper. Poor Rose. <gasps> she can't trust anyone. <laughs> Why are you doing this? No one loves you. And when you're dead, no one will care! <laughs> Enough games. Now you'll drown. I need to get out of this house. First. First? What? Does she only want you? What are you talking about? Look at you! You are beyond worthless! Okay, I'm getting the, the big Sorry, feeling that I'm near the end. <laughs> oh god. I'm dead. Yep. I didn't know the wall opened up. Oh yeah, cheery. While we're doing with it, while I'm doing with this, have you thought about uh, what would you like in return she for the the you. furry OC commission? What are you talking about? Uh, I I do not know. I honestly uh, Look at you. I you have no are idea. Away from you, asshole. Your families. Enough of this shit. Die. Die. Nothing like an angry dead child. Motherfucker! How are you even here? Michael! Good, you made it out. 
I'm more positive than ever that that light is her dad. Probably. No, it's not. You've said that a few times. That little girl? Yeah, and sometimes I'm telling the truth, sometimes I'm lying. Flip a coin. Flip the mouth. That sounds like a euphemism for something. I don't want to know what your brain is thinking of. You put it there. Once again, I don't know what you're thinking. That's why I don't want to know. Because it's you. Alright, don't die. There's no problems this is in there. The fuck? Well, I'm now fully healed. It's RB to suppress. I'm suppressing the best I can. I'm guessing you don't remember what happened in Resident Evil 7. If you'd never been born, it would have been perfect! Don't, I don't remember how to block. I'm confused. Right, I just gave the answer. I I couldn't hear cuz she talking over you. If you can't block, what can? Get my and cover or something? That doesn't count. I don't, I don't know! The dresser, right? That's right in front of her. You have a crouch button. Ow. Still standing right in front of her. I haven't learned a thing. Wait for an opening. Successful. Oh my god. Thank you. Fuck you. Computer. <laughs> you can hear me just fine? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Called Rose. If you'd never been born, it would have been perfect. Oh, bitch. <laughs> Might want to look around you, right? Oh, God, yeah. Fuck you. God damn it. I don't even know where she is. Oh. This is the thing upstairs. Surprise, mother fucker!
Jerry, sorry, I meant to say Jerry, don't let the empathy screw over. You're still dealing with an unstable bioweapon that wants to kill people. Empathy go out the window. That, that's true. What you have! What you want! Rose, look out! Don't give up, Rose. Find that crystal. And that sounded like the father. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. That's the you truth. You've been saying the whole time it was done. You're like, no, it's not. Jerry, that's the joke. And I still can't get this fucking remote open. I think we might have to just get a new one. You know, I've actually... Okay. Also, I've I haven't I know you can, but I haven't seen uh, the the father's face yet. What's all this doing out here? Handgun ammo. Oh, I actually got my handgun back. Handgun for handy. Any gun is handy in the apocalypse. Where the hell am I? What is that? I can sense something from over there we're gonna attack the mega my c with just a pistol <laughs> who the hell are you Anything up here? Yes. Ooh, I'm glad I took that. Just like in the castle. <laughs> okay. You're dead. You're dead. Wait. Hold on. Oh my god. I know why it... What? Why it kept pointing to different areas of the body when I'm trying to look around. Aim assist was on. What's that? It's where the game aims for you. If 
but it doesn't always aim at the at the weak spots. Oh. Oh my God! Why didn't I notice that sooner? Your zombie bitches do nothing to me. Quickly. Damn, I'm okay, so without aim assist, I'm actually better at shooting. <laughs> yeah. I guess it really was the settings that was the issue. Which is funny because aim assist is supposed to help you with aiming. <laughs> One thing that's gonna suck is if I have to fight Mother Miranda again, I'm so fucked. Oh, that's just lovely. Is this where those copies of me came from? See, kids, this is exactly how uh, birth is and what sex is. No. And didn't duplicate Rosemary Winters, with the hope with a perfect replica might serve a, as a suitable vessel. However, the results were less than ideal. It would seem that this, that same, some sort of interference is preventing me from creating a suitable replica. Instead, I've succeeded in making what is essentially a living doll. It resembles the real thing, yes, but has no power. Such a pathetic hus could never pr prove suitable as a vessel. I'll well, I will continue my efforts in hope of discerning the source from the, of this interference. Several hypotheses have come to mind thus far. One, the fact that Rose herself is still alive. Two, some other actor within this realm. Three, a flaw in my methods of production. None of these seem especially likely to be the sole reason, nor are any of them easy problems to solve. Perhaps my best... Hope is to somehow bring Rose into this realm, for she to offer herself as a vessel. It would be so simple. Just for observations. Further experiments with these Rose copies, as I've taken to calling these husks, have yielded, yielded another interesting wrinkle to pursue. When subjected to situations evoking extreme terror, they actually begin to express some semblance of Rose's abilities. He's worn some research, and I think that my first creation, the Mass Duke, is just one to perform this stress test. They couldn't have been watching me the entire time. Could they? Not creepy. Okay. It was seen at some point during my experiments with consciousnesses, an intruder made herself at home in my realm. This intruder is none other than the failure Eveline, who has been running about enacting her own pitiful agenda, which has led us into a slight disruption in my own plans. Had Eveline not interfered, Rosemary Winters would have been on the verge of despair, disposed of her will to live and her beauty-my-seat powers. 
Instead, a new passion burns within her. I shall have to extinguish it. Hmm. God damn it, narcolepsy. Stop making me yawn. I don't have enough space for these bullets. Uh, no. What? God damn it. Thank you! Wait. Handgun ammo, uh... Yeah, I think I'm good for the moment. Guy, okay, almost... Actually, I have 106 ammo. For handgun. I think I'm good for time being. Let's go ahead and reload this. Ah. If narcolepsy was a person and I can punch them, I would There's punch it. I will punch them so hard. So and repeatedly. It must be the crystal. That pull I've been feeling is close, but I just can't go any further. I thought I made it when I saw the blue light, but no, not quite. If only I'd been braver, faster, stronger, so close. I was so close. Black God, which lives in us, and in which we live, create for us a new world, as benefits your will. Your dark consciousness holds for us a second chance, graciously offered and joyously accepted. You drink the blood of the lost lamb as it falls upon your darkened earth, not to destroy, but to preserve, and once again deliver unto life. Hmm. I'm back. I had to get some cake. Huh. Hey, Jerry. Oh, yeah, uh, that's nice. My cake. Yeah, it's... Hey, Jerry, do you think it's possible that Elders gods worship other Elders gods? I can feel it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, why wouldn't they? I still think trying to get rid of your powers is a really stupid idea. Yeah. Because if you can... If you know how to control them, then no one's gonna know that you have them. Yeah. And I'm dead. <laughs> Was it worth it? <laughs> oh, Nami's here. Eh, not to me. Rose, I've waited so long for you. Who, who the fuck are you? Who are you? My name yeah, is... Yeah, you already have a mom. You're not her mom. Well, not currently. So um, powerful. Rose was taken out of Far Mia's care, me so she hasn't seen her mom in a while either. I had to lure you into this realm so that you might willingly use your powers. No, but Kay said, did he? Dumbass kid. Or did I? That was an illusion. Very convincing, wouldn't you say? No way. Now you can become the vessel for my Eva! Someone doesn't know how to move on. Uh, Rose, run! <sighs> Ethan, you pest! Go! Now hear me out. He can manifest. He can't see you, Rose! No one can. Rose! Rose, hurry! You can't escape! Not from me! 
I mean, at this point, just that you can run when you can't die. Meanwhile, they're still running. I couldn't quite hear you. I just turned Bright's game down. I said, at this point, if she wants to be cliche, she should just say you can run, but you can't die. Meanwhile, they're still running. I think she's too obsessed with her dead child. I mean, just accept your kid gone. Don't take other no. kids. You let me call you Michael? I didn't want to Are you just making fun of her now? I just needed you safe. And I'm sorry I left you alone. But I had to find and, like, you. And I respect the pettiness. But take your pettiness out on it's someone else. Ahead. God damn. Rose! Wait, wait. If she's just a real friend, <laughs> Get away from my brother! Stay away from my family! Rose, come on! I didn't say anything in chat. Yeah, I, I see that. No, I didn't. I meant no, you didn't. You can't escape Rose. I mean, she Ethan, did her a little bit. Persistence is all we. Rose, now's your chance. Go live a normal life. Make friends. No one will ever call you a freak again. But. Rose, just go! I don't want to leave you! <laughs> I know. Oh, poor Ethan. I love you. But I need to know that you're Try. safe. So please, just. Ethan, you insolent pest! I got this. Get out of here. He's giving up the ability to be normal to save her dad, or what is left of her dad. All right. It's morphing time. I've got this. You think your powers will allow you to stand against me in the heart of my domain? Foolish. Oh shit! I can teleport. <laughs> I did it too early. <laughs> it just told you how. Are you reading? Left stick plus B equals Mega Mike Seed Attack. Damn it! Offer yourself unto me. This will all There's Can nothing. I just say I absolutely love her character design. Yeah. And I love that. And I love that she just isn't like a huge. There 
punching monster with a bunch of eyeballs. Mm. And she like actually has a fighting style. Why suffer needs? Because honestly, where's the fun in just defeating a mindless monster? And this game made me realize Here wow, I come. Resident Evil boss fight against these giant Don't flesh blobs are kind of lame. Boom, bitch! You've got more white stage to refill. You can't, you gotta refill. Inventory oh. bright. Into so much to learn. But you're incredible. Okay. I don't like this because I can't see where she is. Look, she's a Wait, shoot, does that mean you like your spider form? I'm supposed to do there. No. You have more white page in your inventory. I had two. You might want to check again. Because you overlooked it. No, I meant like the white bar thing. Was I supposed to have more? You might. Why check your inventory because you might have overlooked them. Or no. Down. No, I, I was talking about the blue circle, uh, the white circle shits. Yes, you use sage to refill them. Yeah, I know. I was like, do I need more than two to do that Mother Miranda thing? Yeah. There's nothing. Now watch out, she's gone dolphin. It's okay. Crunchy on Okay, I I'm in teleporting mode. <laughs> Let's see this and also, don't forget they leave items around this the battlefield. Is... If you don't yeah. have any, just search around That's for some orbs or bows. <laughs> just wait for her to tire tire herself out. And then once she's on the ground, see? You have this another one. Also... What? Now just wait for her to come to the ground. And then once How she tires this? herself out, then you got her. I know, I've knocked her down twice. Yeah. I didn't... Oh, I didn't even oh. mean to hit that. It's okay. You have another thing. You can do it. Do it now. I I'm hitting the button. Oh. Left stick and B. <sighs> I didn't. I, don't think I didn't even I don't do it that time. No I'm getting oh, mad right. at these controls. Oh, uh, that's lame, Rose. You can do better than that. That's true. The only one who understands when you're younger, you have worse. When you're younger, you have worse one-liners. 
Yeah, I think the person we should really be talking smack about is the old woman who's talking just as good as the 16-year-old. You just won't give up. I mean, what are you giving up to you? What about those women? That stubborn shine inside makes you the perfect best. <laughs> And I got no more. I did not tell you to do that! Good thing you didn't cast it. Right, it's okay, it didn't use that. Just be aware of your button, press it, and you'll be fine. And just keep shooting. Oh, that works. Alright. Uh, back away, maybe it'll do the Mother Teresa thing. Well, that works so way good. One thing I hate is that it constantly changes my view. What happened? I can't see. Oh boy. Okay, now that's not even fair. Hang on, I just gotta pour some juice on my arm real quick. Hold on. Dad! Did you randomly just say this is delicious food? Are you sick? You have no idea what this is in a video game, do you? You're just like, this is delicious. Everyone share your energy. Oh man, Ethan is kind of badass. Oh yeah. It's... So much power. You truly would have been the perfect vessel for my Eva. I'm not a goddamn vessel. Not some stupid copy. I'm me, Rose. And you're done. I feared you a second time, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. She really misses her daughter. So? What she is her daughter? She wants to every child to get her child. Yeah. Nice. Oh my god! Why are all camera shots not looking at his face? Still! He's, suppo he's supposed to be more of a character. Even though I wasn't there with you. And you know, people, like, if you really want to see Ethan's face, you can. It's been found. Yeah. All you've ever done is protect me. No. Not this time. You lost your chance. I'm so sorry. No. 
it was my choice. And I don't regret it one bit. If I had left you, then we never would have had this chance to talk face to face. This is too much mushy so for my okay. liking. Oh my god, Chill. I'm okay. I'm so proud of you. I'm so very proud of you. I love you all, sir. I love you too, Dad. I feel like there was a lesson to learn here, but I'm not going to figure it out. Mm. Did anyone learn anything Annette? today? Nope. Works for me. I'm back. Someone somewhere learned something about accepting yourself or something. Oh. I say it after the cutscene. Dad. I still can't believe that Chris Redfield is in his mid sixties at this point in the story. <laughs> That's absurd. I refuse to believe it. People age, even characters. No. Meanwhile, Leon is like what? In his. Did I read last time that he was like in his 70s? Touch the moon? Maybe he didn't touch the moon. It's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh. Okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cool. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> Talk to the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. And now I can access story at the end of the game. Where else? Yeah, now you have context for that cutscene. We have a situation. And why she got so mad being called Evelyn. Because she met her. Ever call me that again. Whoa. Whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. We fucked up one. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. Oh my god, my teammates are useless. You know, I don't like him, you know? I know. I like the guy who's walking down the road isn't here this time. Oh wait, there he is. <laughs> yeah, that's Ethan. And now you have context to why you saw him there, and why I lied to tell you that it was just a glitch. Cause spoilerinos.
if you do want one bit of good news after the events of this um DLC, Mia does get well, I wouldn't say she got custody of her again, but she does at least get to see her mom now. Mm. But honestly, that took a lot less amount of time than I thought it would. I don't see that. I think, but it, the only the only reason I kept I died, Evelyn, was because I was stupid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm not listening. Which yeah. is also stupid. You should always listen to me. Because I'm always right. Uh huh. Have I steered you wrong yet? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> when? The multiple times you tried to get bright to go to her doom. That's not a when. I don't exactly time these things. But I'm sure if I went through her different streams, I could tell you the exact time. Oh, you didn't, so I win. That's how oh my it god. Works. In my head, that's how it works. Wait, Heisenberg? I my head. Wait, hold on. Heisenberg was in here? Where? Yes, Bri, I told you during the last stream, I said that they put Heisenberg dialogue when she first went into the hive mind. Oh. They just reused his dialogue from the main game when he said do you know how powerful that kid is you see foreshadowing is a literary device that writers use look i'm not very intelligent than <laughs> last year. yeah i know wait now i realize it's been it's been like almost a week since the last play this Oh, yeah, I played last Saturday, so yeah. Starting tomorrow, it would have been a week. I don't keep an itinerary. I'm not your secretary. You're right, Jerry's my secretary. How am I your secretary? <laughs> don't worry about it. I'm a snake, right? So what arms am I using? You, you got a tail, right? Use it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna get bonked, aren't I? <laughs> what am I seasick? What kind of pa- I have a paddle butt! If you're a snake, aren't you pretty much just one long tail? <laughs> no! In my, head, in my head, that's exactly how it works. That's not how snakes work! In my... Yeah, again, you're underestimating just how much I prioritize my own mind and not other people's. I'm going to point out the tail is after the butthole. I don't know what to do with that information. Uh... Know, use it for hentai. It's not like I'm telling you to look at snake buttholes. Yes, that's something. The, the tail is after the butthole. <laughs> I don't think Jerry oh, heard no. me. What? She said, I don't know what to use for that information. I immediately said, yeah, use it for hentai. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Fucking Kraken. <laughs> I wish they chose a different song for the credits. Yeah. Because I can. 
because, I mean, it's not a bad song, but mm -hmm. variety is always good. Yeah. Shit. Now what? Um, well, I guess I can go down and, and play the horror game with lots of lore if my computer doesn't shit itself. But it is shit, so <laughs> how does that work? <laughs> when I first handled it just fine. <laughs> Everything. Hey. What? What do you mean everything? Don't worry about it. Wait, what you is? Know what? That was nicer. That was a nicer way to speak about his team than I did. Just pretend I said nothing. Here it goes. Everything seems to be just fine. Okay, let me get it loaded on Twitch. And I'll change uh, the Twitch category, obviously. Hopefully everything's fine. And then there, yep. Okay. God. Damn, this other team is hot garbage. They haven't scored a single point. Oh no, my hubris. My hubris is coming back to haunt me. Right. How the fuck did I misspell flathead and put it down as fault head? One of life's great mysteries. <laughs> I already unlocked a bunch of lore. So. So we're gonna. I wanna go read through it because I'm pretty sure Jerry wants to hear the lore. But here we go. I am a lore person. It's one of the reasons why I'm an SCP fan. E. And I'm going to deafen because I'm watching an important video. Okay. Alright. So first tape tomorrow. If you listen closely, you'll hear the crashing waves of tomorrow outside your door. But fear not, stranger, for those waves are for another day. Today those waves shall sleep. If only for a moment. Because today, my friend, is special. Today you will be tested. Again and again. Again. But when it's over, when the waves finally break through and split the door, tomorrow will recede and tremble in awe of what you have become. May the tapes of yesterday provide you with the strength 
that is required for the trials of today. Until tomorrow. That was tape one. Oh, uh, yeah. Before... Did... Wait, Jerry, were you listening to tape one? Yes, I did. Okay. And then I heard food did a thing, and so I did a thing. Yeah, there's actually one thing I, I forgot to do when I started this train, which was deactivate the uh, exercising redeems for today. Because I pulled a muscle in my leg and my arm yesterday. Oh. It still slightly hurts and I don't want to push it. So, I'll, if anyone does redeem it, I'll give your points back. <laughs> there. Next tape. The acceptable melody on the upper floors. The sound can be heard echoing at a distance. That always seemed just out of reach. Some have speculated that it is in some form of communication, echolocation, or even a warning. Although, again, those uh, these remain purely speculative. It is the first of the cephalonic melodies, a triptych of melodies that are experienced throughout the structure. The intent of the sounds and the structure as a whole are currently unknown. And that's the second tape. Hello. This on? Alright, whatever. Um, what do I talk about? Uh, okay. Well, uh, it's May 5th, uh, 19th. And, um, I am keeping a record of my life. Uh, my doctor recommended that I keep a journal because I have uh, early hypertension. <laughs> I mean, thought this would help me clear my thoughts and uh, de-stress. I don't know if that's going to help, but, um, you know, whatever. Uh, what, I guess I'm supposed to talk about my day, right? Uh, well, okay. Um, this week, we are, um, we're starting construction. Or no, sorry, we're finishing construction on, uh, on the, the new accelerator. Which, I mean, it's exciting. It's crazy. It's, it's, you know, the first one of its kind around here, and everyone's, you know, I'm tired of everyone talk about it. Um, personally, I think it's going to flop and fail, and uh, it'll be a huge waste of money. But as long as they keep paying me, I'll keep showing up. So. Yeah. You know as much as I do about the accelerator, Jerry. Okay. <laughs> Granted. You see. See there these there's a row of tapes here and a row at the bottom down here. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of tapes. What do you think of this picture, Jerry? It's a picture. Female, we call they have hair and a face that's blacked out and then a torso. Yeah. F Mac. We call the, these watchers freaky big fellas, no doubt, but relatively harmless. Female. Well, yeah, I suppose that's true. They did get a number of OSC-41, I believe. Alex? Alex something? I forget. It's never been confirmed, though. I read all, through the transcripts a few years ago. All we know is that there was a watcher in Alex. Unknown voice. I believe her name was Kat of Observation Study E6. Femac, really? Well, shit. My bad. Cat, it was Cat, right? Cat disappeared at the same time as the Watcher, but it's mostly just conjecture about what may or may have occurred. UV. What about the sunset recording? Femac. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I've heard of it, but I've also heard of Bigfoot. Doesn't make it. It any more real. UV. Would you like to hear it? And now we're about to see the tape they're talking about. The sunset tape.
The sunset recording, while a popular ghost story amongst those in the early years of the observation study, few actually believed it to exist. It was only after the Foster Wave incident that many of the, of the redacted or classified documents and studies were released to help facilitate a more standardized procedure and reduce the likelihood of a reoccurrence. Initially believed to depict a sunset, hence the name, it has been since been accepted to show the missing OST member Cat Redacted. While it has long since been confirmed that missing OS members undergo some sort of cellular photogenic translation, the sunset recording marked the first instance of the structural regurgitation. So now you know what happened to Cat. The next tape, I don't even know what it is. Because I didn't, because that's when I saw the OBS issues from yesterday. Listen for the waves, Flathead. From the depths, their songs will guide you to, a, to new shores. And that's it. Now you got, you're about to see what the gameplay is. It, the gameplay is so hard, Jiri. I'm just letting you know. It is so difficult. Oh god, the lag is still here. Hold on. I might have to be able to like... No, not... I Yo! Graphics. Is there lag? Once I get in this area. Because this is the game area. I can't. I can't play like this. It doesn't. It wasn't like this before. Why is it all of a sudden. Oh, you can't play. So once I get here, I'm fine. Go over here. Lag. Wait, I want to see something. I want to see something. Nope, didn't fix it. I don't know what's going. Oh, wait. I'm able to move my mouse really fast. Nope. In the menu, I can move it fast. Everywhere else, not so much. I guess I'm gonna just have to put that on hold. Cause it's... 
some reason, I'm, I'm guessing there's glitches on it. So hold on. Do you have other horror games? Nothing on Steam, because one of the games that... Uh, the only other horror game on Steam I want to do is a stream of its own. So let's go to Itch.io. Dealing with technical difficulties. Yeah. Uh, oh, here we go. I got a horror game. Yeah, because apparently Flathead, it, 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 it's having issues. I guess I'll never find out anything about the bare basics. That just makes me more interested. Well, granted, it didn't. I think it only came out a few days ago, so there's probably some bugs. Uh. Yeah. That or, other, or otherwise, my computer is a, it's a sack of shit. It could be either, or both. Or both. Yeah. <laughs> I still got a bunch of other horror games I got, so don't worry. This next one's probably gonna finish out the stream anyways. I'm not sure if I even fully finish it tonight, but it's a- They Are Here! Alien Adduction Horror. Oh god, that one. <laughs> you know it! <laughs> yeah. I- I watch each other streamers from time to time. I- I watched Whiskey Dingo play it, and... It is a game. It is definitely a game. I know it from what I... Like a good game from how you're I believe it makes fun of people who believe aliens are real, right? From what I mean, I think, I, I think aliens are real. Statistically <laughs> speaking, they are. It's just a matter of why we haven't found any yet. And that's what's known as the Fermi Paradox. Oh. Hold on. I just taught you science. That'll be fifty dollars. Huh. Apparently the one I got on Itchio is only... Oh wait, it's also a demo on, on, on Steam, never mind. <laughs> I thought it was the full game! Oh, wait, that's porn. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. So yeah, this is only a demo, because I don't think they finished it yet. Well, I mean, that's the definition of demo. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Shit. I will have to say that while I do not believe most of the abduction stories are real in any way whatsoever, I don't think it's funny to make fun of those people. Eh. Yeah. Make, make fun of right. those. People who were who believed they were abducted. Yeah. Anyways, the broke tells the story of a first UFO contact that happened 30 years ago. 
before the events shown on the demo version. The main character is a, pri is a private Michael Anderson who serves at a military base near Gracewood Farm. By chance, he becomes a witness of terrible and inexplicable events. Inexplicable. Yeah. Anyways, this is the origin story to Mr. A uh, Anderson for Anderson Robotics. <laughs> Cheery. Right? No. <laughs> Bad, bad little kid. Delta, this is Alpha. We've an unidentified oh, object minute. at 270. I might have been thinking of a different game. Do I don't think copy? this is the one I've seen. Alpha, is that a meteor? But yeah, Thank I'm not gonna discount to anyone who you entering control says that they were abducted. What are your it's like me saying that Introducer. if someone saw God, I, how am I supposed to prove that they were lying? Yeah. I wasn't there. <laughs> I will say, some are very believable, like, man, the one guy that, that was basically a woodcutter, basically other people that saw him get abducted sold his story and that's how hollywood ended up getting it he never oh, sold yeah, it at any the, point i forget the, i forgot the name of that case but yeah that's probably that's probably the most reliable abduction story out there yeah and i don't blame him for getting pissed for hollywood basically help taking other people's stories about his abduction and then making a movie and just adding fluff everywhere where he didn't say because he didn't want to tell his story. And then the people that were there and like tried to tell everyone and didn't believe them, they were all treated like idiots. And everyone mocked them and were like, he wasn't abducted, you just killed a guy. And then he turns back up and they're like, Dude, where have you been? We thought your friends murdered you for reasons. He's like, No. Okay, before, before I, I start the game, I need to read this. Because it just popped up for me on Twitter. No reading. The opposite of Microsoft Office is Macro Hard on Fire. That's lame. That's corny. <laughs> very, very corny. <laughs> Anyways, I'll start paying attention at all to the intro, so I have no idea what the fuck to do. I read you five by five, sir. Out. I I hate the, those bug buzzing noises. I hate them so much. Really? Yeah, they are obnoxiously loud and like right in my ear. I'm actually used to those bug noises because I hear them a lot during the summer. I was gonna say something. This is Omega. We see you. We are monitoring. I used to hear frogs a lot where I used to live because there were creeks fucking everywhere. Now I live in Southern California and the only thing I hear is coyotes. Coyotes are just puppies. No. Yes. There's literally Damn. areas I can't go outside at night because coyotes. Jerry, you're a snake. Just eat them. Jeez. Coyotes eat snakes! Oh, Megger, this is Michael Anderson. I report radiation detected. The counter indicator is average. Roger that, we're all quiet here. Clock. Oh, wait. 
for you. I'm proud of you. I do nothing. The object I'm just the kidding, Clay. I'm gonna fun, but I want no. Jerry, that's what's known as sass. Oh, you're a sassy, sassy mouse. Good. Come back, Jerry. Oh, wow. A lot of radioactivity. Omega, I'm gonna grow a second penis. Devices. Radiation levels rising over. Right. What if it, what if it actually did work? work like that? <laughs> people would either be, people would either be a lot happier, or there would be a lot more cancer cases. <laughs> they would have something in common with venomous snakes. Wait, was there actually a person born with two penises before? I mean, I'm sure there has been, right? Human <laughs> biology is messy. If there are literally people born with an extra finger or an extra toe, I don't think an, an extra dick is out of the question. Jesus! Fuck. Fuck. There ain't no Jesus here. There Anyways, let's go. Let's be white and go towards it. <laughs> well, I wish you the best of luck. I'll go back Can to safety. Hear me? Over. And I will not try to rescue you. Can anyone answer? I am now predator, but not the bad type of predator. <laughs> Bright, you're not in a tropical jungle, so no, you're not. Predator <laughs> hunts in tropical jungles. Don't you know anything about science? I mean, I saw them. I saw them, there was one movie where they were in a city. That was a stupid. Yeah, it was like one pre big predator had it hunting a small predator. Do you want to know what the funniest part is? What? I've never seen that movie. I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm just trying to get a reaction out of people. Yeah. Okay. Funny how that keeps happening. How? It's a giant pizza. I wish my hair would stop falling on my face. Give me a moment. Wait, what happened? Oh, all lights went off. <coughs> oh! They're all naked. I want to get anal probed. Well, that's not very fair. What, do you want to take my probing? <laughs> yeah, we 
Leave some for the rest of us. God damn, don't be greedy. <laughs> Chiri! Chiri just stay here! You like, why am I here? Chair. You can have my chair. <laughs> Unexplained phenomenon occurred at Gray was Gray's Wood Farm. On the night of August 7th, the Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction and at different speeds. After a while, they vanished. This strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy, the dog became aggressive, Try to attack him and bit him. Children complained that someone was someone was walking under their windows. To I okay. Former P Peter yeah. Sh Huh? I was gonna say, as you know, the animals can get a little quirky at night. Oh my god. Farmer Peter Sherman himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to oneself? Or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to Grayswood Farm to take a photo and make a report for a local newspaper. This is where I get captured and annually probed. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's a not an, an absent possible. It's not impossible. Huh. Okay, so this is actually starting off a lot different from what I've seen from another person playing the game. Well, if there's only a demo out, then of course it's going to change until they make the full game. This is great material for a news report. Yeah, just two <laughs> circles in the sky. Oh, wait, no, just three. <laughs> right, so, oh, there's only a demo, a demo out of the game. Why That's... does it keep changing? That's going to be clip. Let me just look it up. There's, oh, there's two. Yeah, two circles in the sky. <laughs> it's gonna clip's gonna be called Bright Can't Count. <laughs> you can't. Yeah, you can. Don't worry, I won't count for you, but I can cook. Just not for you, because I don't love anyone. Farmer's note. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment, but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went out to town for help. My son and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. Be careful, Peter Sherman. Hello? Can't open that. Oh look, it's Coke. Brian, please, you need to be careful about the things you say on Twitch. Stop being dumb. It's literally the, the name of the soda. Right. Oh. Right, I'm playing right, I'm playing Splatoon. I'm not I'm not watching the whole stream all the time. Sometimes the off brand of Coke can taste better than the actual brand. And be honest, Bray, what reason would I have to not think that you're talking about the other kind? <laughs> Chill. Also, I hope that people at this house realize if you leave milk out in the refrigerator for too long, it's gonna go bad. I feel like most people that graduated, that have gone through kindergarten, know that, right? Most people know that dairy go in the fridge. E. Oh, 
okay. Was that the drawing was made by the missing daughter of the farmer. The paper is painted on both sides. Oh. Well, okay then. The aliens murder dogs. Got it. Dumbass dog. Percent. This is my daughter's room. Oh my god. This is my daughter's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise. When I came in, she wasn't in her bed. No window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. Members, members of the Sherman family. Yeah. Apparently, following the missing girl, if you listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. Photo from the internet. Perhaps Sherman saw something similar. It looks creepy. Photo from the internet. Okay. It's just gonna say the same shit. <laughs> this this alien made it look like it's high. Anyways. <laughs> Yes, it has narrowed eyes, almost like it has eyelids. Spooky eyelids. Yeah, sticker. Found my old diary from when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that? Diary text. Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. I saw the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true. <sighs> I was fishing from the abandoned pier on the river. Suddenly, I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around, very low above the ground. A huge disc with four flashing lights or, or windows was hovering. I felt a punch that seemed to throw me in the, into the air. I froze there as if in zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly bright, and I seemed to lose consciousness. We were seeing three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed on a table, as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicated with each other telepathically. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening and barely made it home. My head was buzzing. And I walked home as if in a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body and, and two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. You were anally probed. Anyways. Right. Alright, how old is the character you're reading about right now? Oh shit. I don't know. Exactly. But I will comment the item is called Children's Diary. So, stop thinking with your adult brain and start thinking with your adult brain. I need to get the rid of the other shit. Alright, serious question. If you were abducted by aliens that weren't hostile, or not, at least not obviously hostile, what would you do? Right. What, what I would do like if aliens were hostile? Well, I would just no. whip out the gun. No. And yeah. if they were not hostile, and they abducted you and, like, brought you onto their ship. Eh, I'd probably actually have an anal probing machine. <laughs> well, that's a good way to- right, that's a good way to potentially start a war. Where <laughs> nukes can only do so much, and they do more harm than good. And I was actually asking seriously. Honestly, Honestly I don't know what I would do. <laughs> if I were abducted, and and of course this is assuming that they can understand me, because they, they, they may not understand me, I would probably just, like, take that 
opportunity to like ask them stuff like are there like like how come you haven't revealed yourselves to us fully yet is there anything that you can give me safely to prove that I actually met you etc is there anything that you can teach me that can help make my world better because not great because like if you're given a rare opportunity like that make the most of it yeah Jerry your turn share with the class oh my god I'm gonna die <laughs> no. Yeah, you gotta do it quickly. Like, Jerry's gonna die. You're shooting lasers at me. No. If that, if that I got probably trying to figure out how to communicate and just communicate. Because honestly, I feel like people would not believe me no matter what I say. So why not just try to to be nice? Be nice yeah. to how? That that's vague. Plus, what you think is like, nice. Ask they them their name, nice. how are they, what they want, what they mean specifically, not with humans. No, no food, no chosen one. You wouldn't take the opportunity to, like, ask, mm. is there anything that you can like teach us because like no one has to believe you if what you say like if you present it to someone like if you're able to like act on what they tell you who cares if people believe you were abducted or not you're forgetting i'm someone with a very poor memory skill my photophobia why... basically makes my memory useless jerry there's a very easy solution to the problem that you are describing. What? It's called ask them to record it or like write it down for you in a way that you can understand later. I could ask them if they could fix my photophobia. Exactly. There are multiple solutions. In that case, there are multiple solutions to the issue you just mentioned. Anyways. Yeah, that would be awesome if they could fix my crooked leg. Mm -hmm. Or if I could have a I new knee. I don't know. I didn't think that... I, my That's not what my head went to. My thought was just they could... Like, like you underestimate the power of a pen and paper. Yeah. Anyways, we ready to continue the game and read the note? No. Fuck you. Anyways. I've learned a lot... <laughs> yeah, and anyways, I've learned a lot about these things. They're called the Greys. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's a bad thing to say. Or not. <laughs> right, it's that's not a, a bad thing. That's an established trope of aliens. That's like one of the famous depictions of aliens, and they are called. And they are called greys or gray because, aliens. Yeah, yeah. They're called greys because they have gray or white skin typically. <laughs> anyway. Not all the time, but usually. <laughs> eh, these are not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous creatures. Basically, they can be described in the following way a large head, disproportionate to the body, no hair, bottomless black eyes. Gray skin, long thin limbs, their voices are like nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky near home, which move along a certain way. Then people start to have a nosebleed, have severe headaches and a buzz in their ears, and animals start raging. Next, people start to have memory lapses. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places. For example, in the middle of a field or on a road, few kilometers away from the house. Some of them ha have flashbacks of terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences. 
The aliens established control over their minds, and this has affected their psyche. Also, they found the marks on the body, incisions to be exact, during a palpitation. It felt like some, something thick, like a foreign object moving under the skin. Um, aliens, I, I, I gotta find it to freeze flashlight, and I'm not afraid to use it. Child headaches began to bother me. They tortured me to this day. I see the doctors a dozen of times, but no one could explain the reason for their occurrence. Now I understand why the doctors cannot determine the cause of the migraines. The answer is simple: abduction. Okay, I know that. Huh? That that it, I was gonna say that is an absurd leap in logic. <laughs> yeah. That I will make fun of. <laughs> yeah. I remembered the alien abduction when I found my old diary. It was then that the migraines began. The cuts that I mentioned it then behind the ear were a trace of them. I'm sure they, they've implanted something in me, some kind of transmitter or implant. Because of this, I forgot everything. I definitely decided that I would get it. I'm not crazy. Oh, that reminds me. Another thing I would do if I were abducted. After I asked what I wanted to what I wanted to ask, I would ask another like really important question. Should I ever want or need to? Is there a way I can get in touch with you again? Ah. Anyways, in the note, Peter Sherman claims that he cut out the alien implant. Maybe take it? Fuck it, I'll take it. I'll die anyways. Uh. Photo of dead animals. I swear if one of these is a picture of a dead dog. Okay. Oh, the ringing? Yes. <laughs> that legitimately hurt. I don't like certain noises. There's certain noises some games make that are unfriendly for people's health. That's my first note for <laughs> Immersion, and that's great, but please tone it down. Yeah. Okay, I got in the car. Everything's fine, Chew. My ears aren't. And yeah, I'm dead. Have you considered not dying? Wait, wait, can I turn it down? There we go. And 
and I'm dead. What am I doing? I'm destroying my eardrums. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> that actually didn't scare me. In the full game, you'll find the large territory of your was farm and a full story of alien abduction. Add against your wishes so you don't miss out on the scan and release. And that's it. What well, it was a demo. Yeah, I didn't know it was a demo. You literally said it was a demo. Don't pull that. You're like, I don't know, I didn't know that this thing that I said was a demo was a demo. Yeah, I, you know what I, anyways. Um. I don't think this has a Twitch category. Then do games and demos. I'm so so glad you taught me that shoe. <laughs> Cause I never knew that existed and I was just put like just chatting. I know, I could tell. Let's Anyways, the next game is Airtime. A flight so comfortable, you'll wish it was longer. Unless it's on a plane made by Boeing. What In now? In which case, please tell me you haven't heard about what all that shit happening with Boeing airplanes. No, I have not. You haven't heard the story, so landing gear falling off, or entire panels of the planes coming off while it's in the air. Nope. Yeah, basically, Boeing used to be uh, practically run by engineers, and then someone who knew nothing about planes bought it. And that's when things started to go down, let's say. And. They're like, we totally know more about airplanes than engineers that build airplanes. Let's make money. And then the What's whistle the worst blowers. that can happen? And then the whistleblowers that were supposed to speak in court started dying. Yeah. Isn't totally that not fun? Fixed. And one of them even said, if I wind up dead in the near future, I am not, you are not, you know what, all. If I, if I am dead, it was not an accident. Now that the other one, the other one that died, I do think was like purely a coincidence, but come on. It, it, it's, co it's comic book levels of villainy at this point. Someone's gonna expose you and then they wind mm -hmm. up dying right before they can expose you. Why well, is this fantastic seeing a game again? Just wake up. <laughs> well, did you wake up? Press. I can crouch while sitting. Yeah, you can crouch down by 
you're sitting. I've switched off the seat belts. You can just have you can feel oh shit. The about the cabin at your leisure. The time right now is flying with cats. The Holy Trinity of airline food. Man tastes dream. Approximately three hours. Serge's fruits are pretzels, poor fool. How many languages do our sandwiches know? Yes. Helpful <laughs> brand shoot thing. Oh my gosh, I can toss shit. Psst, excuse me. Hey, hey, psst, hey, hey, listen. Hello? Oh, why are they staring at me? Did you do something cringe? Possibly. Oh, stare at that. Wait, was there just a pack of something back there? Shit. Are you kidding me? Uh... Hey, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Psst, psst, hey. I hate this game. Excuse me, hey, hey, excuse, excuse me. I think I'm gonna leave the chat to go take a nap. Okay. Have fun. Oh dear God. No longer. Oh, oh, oh. Robot wants to know if you're having a good day. They got a working TV over there. That's fucking bullshit. Oh, I did she even hear you talking? Oh, yeah. Anyway, later. Hmm. And now you're stuck with me. Well, not for much longer. I'm not sure if I'll play another game after this or not. I'm not going to wear the headphones because I don't want to be copyright claimed. What was the song I was playing? Right? What? What was the song that was playing? It... I don't... I don't know. It... Are you thirsty? It just... Absolute just gave random shit. Uh, they, they're just dumping the entire bag of infinity pretzels on me. Infinity Everyone gets pretzels. pretzels. Everyone gets pretzels. <laughs> so, what I'm thinking is, is that I just have to in keep annoying the stewardess <laughs> the, to progress. Oh. You have to become a kick streamer. Oh my god, I know who you're referencing. I forgot their name though. I'm not, re I'm not re referencing any one person. Are there are thirsty? lots of, of those Absolute disgusting, alleged 
allegedly people on the internet now. I wonder if the stewardess is getting sick of my bullshit. I just heard pss, pss, hey, hey. Who said that? Probably someone trying to get your attention. Consuming me so fast. Okay, she's actually is getting mad. Damn lot of pretzels. Is it wrong to toss pretzels at the person in front of you on an airplane? So I have no idea if I'm actually doing this correctly. Are there instructions anywhere? Nope. Oh wait. Did you put Oh wait, is time changing? Look outside. Oh yes, time is changing. Maybe it's like a financial phrase thing. I just gotta go until six AM. Hold on, it's one way to tell. I just... I am going to go get set up for my stream, which means I'm going to head out. You have fun with your playing game. Uh.
I honestly don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. Can I be told what to do? I am so confused. What the fuck? Yes, yes, they are. All right. Smell tight. Spell tight. I hate my phone.
Okay, there we go. I did spell it wrong. Give me a moment, Danger Noodles. Alright, there's the raid words. Anyways, Danger Noodles, I hope you enjoyed me finishing being that DLC. Stream's gonna be way longer tomorrow. And I'm gonna start earlier, too. We'll be happy how it was burger farm time. Well, probably not. Probably not start. It'll probably be something else to start. Anyways, thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed. See you guys next time for your next mission. And we'll be raiding my good friend Hatchet. Make sure you use the raid word. You've got it, Danger Noodles. Use the raid words I have given you. In three, two, one.